everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel on the art of alopecia. For those who don't know me, my name is Marcy and I have an autoimmune condition called alopecia universalis. Basically what that means is my immune system mistakenly attacks my hair follicles and that is why I am completely bald and balding throughout my body. And on this YouTube channel, we primarily do wig reviews, um, but I have done some tips, tricks, tutorials, q and all of that fun stuff. And I'm also very active on two other social media platforms I have my Instagram and my TikTok. You can find me under the name The Art of Alopecia. And I also have a Gmail account. Um, so if you don't necessarily feel comfortable contacting me via social media, you can email me at theartofalopecia at gmail.com. If you have any questions or concerns or in need of support, I would be happy to chat. Oh my goodness, now that that intro is out of the way, guys, hello. How are you guys? It's been so long. It's been like a few months since I've posted on YouTube, but I'm happy to finally get back into the swing of things. School took me by storm. Um, and I just didn't necessarily have a whole lot of wigs to review. Um, so I'm coming back strong and I'm gonna be reviewing not just one wig in this video. I'm gonna be reviewing three um, from a company that I love dearly. For those who have been following me for a while, may or may not have seen that I did a review about a year ago on Jadora Secrets. <laughs> um, for those who remember, or if you need a little bit of a reminder, it was the most luxurious wig I think I have I think I think I think that I own, honestly, by far, and it was their Jessica unit that I reviewed. It's like this long princess caramelly brown. It was just like absolutely stunning. So they have kindly sent me three wigs today to review, and I am super duper excited. I hope you guys are excited, but we are coming back strong with three wig reviews in one video. I'm so excited. Okay, so the structure of this video is gonna look a little bit different because I usually take a good chunk of time reviewing like the boxing and doing a little bit of an unboxing for you guys. Um, but since I have so much to get through today, I am not gonna do that, but I will show you the box and I will share a little bit of things. So this is the box. How gorgeous is it? It is one of their envelope boxes and y'all know that I love a good envelope box because it's nice and secure. And then the inside, how freaking stunning is that? And um, just for like the most luxurious touch, they added in like some um, Chador Secret ribbon. So they, they packaged the box really, really nicely. And um, they sent me a whole bunch of Chador <laughs> Secret drawstring bags. So this is what they look like. They are like a satin material with their logo. I don't know if you can see that, but as you guys know, I love drawstring bags. They are great for storage and they are great for travel because as I always say in all of my videos, when you are investing in a high quality product, you wanna make sure that you are investing in high quality storage for your wigs because you want the wigs to be protected when they are not on your head. But that's basically it. Got two boxes, got some drawstring bags, had some really pretty ribbon on it. Nothing else to really say, but I think we should get into the wigs because I'm getting too excited. <laughs> Alrighty, babes, let's get started. I am over the moon looking at these wigs. They are just so gorgeous. When I think of Jadora Secrets, I think of perfect hair, dream hair, princess hair, fairy tale hair, luxurious hair. Like, sincerely, probably the best place to get your dream, dream hair. Unless your dream hair isn't like long locks. I feel like Jadora Secrets, they are known for their long locks of really high quality hair, um, but they do have some really great short styles. Um, but anyways, I'm gonna get into the first wig. So introducing Miss Haley. <laughs> she is so, 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 so stunning. So Haley is 18 inches in length. She is 150% in density. Um, honestly, I think this is probably my favorite density. It's not too, too heavy, but it's not also too light. But again, it all depends on personal preference. She is a medium sized cap and I'm gonna look down because I need more information on the specs. I have my laptop. Um, she is a lace top. 
Um, she has a machine wefted back. She has a resistance band. Y'all know that I love my resistance band. And she also has a comb that can be easily removed if you'd like. And we've got some adjusted straps. Her knots, I believe, are bleached. Invisible transparent lace, bleach knots. I was onto it, I was onto it. She has a natural hairline with baby hairs as well. So as you can tell, there are a little bit of baby hairs throughout the hairline, which is fantastic because that adds a whole other layer of realism, which I love. So let's try her on already. It is showtime. So resistance band on first. Tuck the wig back, pull it back. Oh my goodness, guys. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness, I get so excited every time I put on a Jodora unit because it's just, the hair is just so silky smooth and it's so stunning. Okay, let's talk about it. So I have cut the lace. Um, I have not cut in any ear tabs yet. Um, but I'm gonna give you guys an up close on the hairline. I think this baby hair needs to be um, glued back or else it's gonna just, just gonna stick there. <laughs> um, okay, let me show you guys this hairline. So here we have a very, very natural hairline and the knots are completely bleached so it really creates the illusion that your hair is growing out of your scalp. I am absolutely obsessed. Oh my goodness. And then the part, the other side. Stunning, oh my goodness. So in terms of parting the hair, you can part it wherever the lace is. So if you wanted a side part, know that you can do it there. You just have to train the hair to go that way. But how? Stunning is this. Oh my goodness, I'm absolutely obsessed. <laughs> I'm gonna try and turn around to show you guys the back. Just note that it may look a little chunky from the back just because this is a medium cap size and I'm usually a small, but know that Jadora Secrets do have small cap sizes. I don't know if they have one in the Haley, but if they do, I will link it down below. Okay, so here is the side. <laughs> I'm so excited. And then the back. And then another side. <laughs> oh my goodness, guys. This is so, so, so freaking stunning. Before I move on to the on to the next week, can we just like can we just take a moment to like stare at that hairline? Just like stare at it. I'm staring at myself and like there is no way that anyone would be able to tell that this is a wig. It truly does look like it's coming out of my scalp, which is like the most amazing thing that a wig could ever accomplish. Like I am absolutely obsessed. So as I said, this is human hair. All of these are human hairs. So you can curl it, you can straighten it, you can crimp it, um, you can dye it, but wouldn't recommend dyeing it because the hair color is so, so, so stunning. But um, you can do every, anything you want with it. You can have fun with your hair. The only thing that I would recommend doing is treat your human hair wig as if it was your own hair growing out of your scalp because it does need to be taken good care. So use that heat protectant. You are straightening or curling or putting heat on it. Um, get those high quality products in terms of like shampoo, conditioners, and oils and stuff like that. I need to be obsessed with the next one because I'm obsessed with all of them. So let's move on to it. Okay, now we are moving on to something that is completely polar opposite to Haley, and I want to introduce you to Miss Emmy. Guys, guys, guys. Okay, so Emmy is 22 inches in length. She is like half of my body. Um, how crazy is this? How stunning. Um, I believe she's 180% in density, so she is a little bit thicker in depth, but just like absolutely stunning. And she is also a medium cap size. Her um, cap construction is the exact same, so I did cut the lace, but I haven't cut the ear tabs. She is still a lace top with machine wefted back. Um, the only difference is she has two combs on her sides, whereas Haley only had a comb at the 
back. But again, those are removable if you want. And it has the adjustment straps at the back as well. And again, bleach knots, same hair quality, still human hair, still comes with baby hairs. Let's throw her on. So I'm gonna put on my adjustment resistance band. Oh my freaking god! I think we just need to have a moment of silence for this wig. Okay, let me... Okay, yeah, let me lower you guys so you guys can see it. Guys, she is so, so stunning. Oh my goodness, okay, let me stand up or stand up on my bed. Like, look at these stunning highlights throughout. Oh my goodness, so, so gorgeous. Like, this is, I think, a natural black shark. Sorry, I should have explained the color specs, but it definitely looks like a natural, natural black or a natural dark brown um, with some caramel highlights. But let me give you guys an up close of the hairline. So as I said, I still need to cut the ear tabs but just to give you guys an idea. <laughs> oh my goodness, guys, this looks like it is growing out of my scalp. Like how stunning is that? Okay, other side. Oh my goodness, I need to adjust it accordingly. And then the part, so stunning. And then give you guys a little back. So she's also a medium cap size. So again, she is a little bit too big for me. Um, but again, just know that Jador's Secrets do have small sizes in a lot of their popular wigs. I'm just absolutely obsessed. Can we talk about the hair quality? Like I am running my fingers through this hair and it is just like the softest thing ever. Like it truly, oh, and it smells so nice. It is just, oh, <laughs> medium cap size, <laughs> too big for my head. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with everything that Jadora Secret creates. Like how stunning. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, we gotta move on to the next one or else I'm just gonna keep get caught up and make this video longer than it needs to be. But this is Miss Emmy and I would highly, highly, highly recommend. You can still do everything that you want with Emmy than you can do with Haley. Um, still human hair. I'm gonna stop rumbling, but this is such a gorgeous unit. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna stop the video now. <laughs> Okay, last but not least, introducing Miss Destiny. She's kind of a mixture between Haley and Emmy. Um, got that blonde, but we've got that dark, dark, dark root. Oh my gosh, she is stunning. So Destiny is 20 inches in length, so kind of a bit in the middle of the, them two. She is 180% in density, so she's still got that full, that fullness to her. And she is another medium size cap, but same cap construction as Emmy, still has the combs, resistance band, the adjustment straps, the front lace or the lace top, machine wefted back. Let's throw her on. Resistance band on first. Oh my goodness. She reminds me of my Jessica unit. She is very similar, very similar to my Jessica unit. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, moment for the hairline. As I said, I still need to cut the ear tabs, but here we have the hairline. Knots are completely invisible. The part, you can part her wherever you want. So if you want a 
side part, then you can absolutely do that as long as you train the hair to go the way that you want. Guys, 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 guys! She is so, so, so stunning. Okay, let me give you guys a back, a back look. Like the hair is just like so freaking smooth. Okay, now that I've kind of shown you all of the wigs, let's talk about kind of the limitations with this kind of cap construction. Let's get this tag out of the way. Um, so she, since she is a lace top, as I said, you can um, create anything within the lace and that's gonna look natural. So if you wanted to do like some French braids going down, um, you would have to stop at around here, else you will start to see the wefts at the back. You can do like a half up, half down, which is really great within the lace. Um, you can't necessarily do a high ponytail just due to the cap construction. Um, if you're looking for a high ponytail, then I would recommend a full lace, but know that you do have to glue the circumference of your head down. Um, but you can do a low pony, which is still adorable. A nice long braid would look so cute. I'm so sad that this review is coming to an end because I could just like talk about these wigs forever and ever and ever. Like moment, moment of applause for all of these. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, guys. They're just so great. They're so freaking pretty. It, if you're looking for a luxurious wig, then go to Victoria's Secret. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna stop talking. Um, but I'm probably gonna be talking about these wigs for the next few months because I'm obsessed and I wanna continue wearing them and talking about them. Um, but go check out Jador's Secret. They are absolutely wonderful. They have the most luxurious princess-like wigs. I do have a discount code um, for you guys to save a little bit of money, actually a lot of money. If you think about it, when, you're, when it's 10% off, of like a really expensive product you're actually saving like a few hundred dollars which is like amazing um so my discount code is down below and i will also link these wigs down below so you don't have to worry about hunting for them i know Haley has a few different options on their website um but i will make sure to list the proper one but that is it for today's video guys thank you so 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 much for watching thank you for your patience too um with me me being away for a quite some time um, but we will see you next time on the art of alopecia bye guys